Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh I'm Muhammad Rifgamim From a class 5D English Education Department Okay Here I will present Material about Case studies and experiments What is case study? It could be argued that any research in social science is a case. Case study might include experiment, action research, survey, naturalistic result, participatory research, historical research, and etc. And case study research use multiple methods for data collection and analysis. In other words, it operates as many other types of research. Types of case study According to STEC, identif identifies three main types of case study. One, intrinsic case study or studies that are undertaken in order to understand the particular case in question. 2. Instrumental case studies or examine, examining a particular case in order to gain insight into an issue or a theory. 3. Multiple or collective case study or groups or of individual studies that are undertaken to gain a fuller or more general picture. Advantage and disadvantage of case study According to Nisbet and White uh, 1984 Strength and weakness of a case study And the first is strengths 1. The results are more easily understood by a wide audience Including non academics as they are frequently written in everyday non-professional language. 2. They are immediately intelligible. They speak for themselves. 3. They catch unique features that may otherwise be lost in large scale data. These unique features may hold the key to understanding the situation. 4. They are strong on reality. 5. They provide insight into others, similar situa situation and cases. There be assisting interpretation of other of other similar case sick they can undertaken by single researcher without needing a full research team seven they can embrace and build in unanticipated events and uncontrolled variables and about weakness number one the result may not be general, general except where other readers or researchers see their application. Number two, they are not easily open to cross-checking. Hence, they may be selective, be as personal and subjective. Number three, they are prone to problems or observer bias. Despite attempts made to address reflex reflexivity, and about reliability and validity in case study, will case studies may may not have the external checks and balance found in other form of research. Never does 
they still buy by canons of validity and reliability for example construct validity or talk employing except definition and construction of concept and term Op operationalizing the research and its me measures are criteria exactly and internal validity talk ensuring agreements between different part of the data matching pattern of a result ensuring that findings and interpretations derived from the data transparently that casual explanation are supported by the evidence or alone and that rival explanation and inference have been weak and found the be less exactly that the explanation or inference met again based on evidence and external validity or clarifying the context theory and domain to which general generalization can be met reliability or replicability and internal consistency and avoidance of bias example the case study simply being an embodiment or fulfillment of the researchers initial prejudice or suspicions with selective data being gathered or data being used selectively planning a case study according to thomas and myers 20 and 15 suggests that in planning a case study researchers must consider whether the case, stu case study is singular or multiple they need to focus on in Institution, understanding, theorization, and analysis, and using thick description, connect analysis with explanation. According to Hamilton and Corbett, Wither, Wither, uh, twenty and thirteen, identif identify key decision in approaching the planning of a case study. Number one, self reflection. Number two, research question. Number three, defining your methodological approach. Number number four, four strategic approaches. Or who will, who that, when and with whom. Number five, getting organized. Number six presenting the finding case study design and methodology according to yin 20 and 9 identifies your main case study design the single case design can focus on critical case and extreme case a unique case a represent or typical case a ref revelatory case a longitudinal case the embedded single case design in which more than one unit of analysis is incorporated incor incorporated into design for example a case study of a whole school might also use subunits of classes, teachers, students, parents, and each of these might require different data collection instrument. For example, a survey questionnaire, interview, observation, and etc. The multiple case design, for example, comparative case studies within an overall piece of research or replication case studies 
the embedded multiple case design in which different sub units may be involved in each of different case and a range of instruments. Example a survey questionnaire, interview, observations, archival record, and etc. may be used for each sub unit and it is keep separate to each case. Sampling in case study. Sampling has a dual meaning here. The participants in case study or the kind of case study to be adopted. Data in case study. According to Yin 2000, according to Yin 20 and 9, identifies documents, documents. For example, letters, emails, memorand, agendas, units, report, records, diaries, notes, other studies, newspaper, article, website, upload, and etc. And archival records, for example, public record, organizational record, and report, personal, or maybe medical or behavioral and personal data stored in an organization or with due care to privacy legislation char and maps interview in the focus and formal survey interview and the direct observation and participant observation and the last is physical Artefact, for example, pictures, furniture, decoration, photographs, and ornaments. What makes a good a case study research, researcher? A case study requires in-depth data. Researcher ability to gather data that address fitness for purpose and skill in probing beneath the surface of phenomena. These requirements imply that the researcher must be an effective questioner, listener, prober, able to make informed inference, to read between the lines, and adapt to changing and emerging situations. Further, the effective case study researcher will need to post the ability to collect and synthesis data from different sources to make inference and interpretation based on evidence to know how to test inference and conclusion or and how to test them against rival explanation and now how to report multiple perspective okay next about experiment experiment makes several claims scientific credibility repeatability present and causality the grid claim the experimental methods particular particularly RCTC is that they demonstrate casuality that an outcome has been caused by a specific intervention. The essential feature of experiment research is that investigators deliberately control and manipulate the condition which determine the event in which they are interested. Introduce an intervention and measure, measure the difference that it makes. Randomized control trials. Random, ran, randomized control tra, trial, a, a true experiment or discuss discusses below 
of considerable, considerable prominence in education. Key elements of a randomized controlled trial. The key factor in the experiment were the random selection of the seeds from a population of seeds, the random allocation of the randomly selected sample of wheat into two match group involving the initial measurement of the size size of the weight to ensure that it was the same for both groups the identification identification and isolation of k variable the control of the k variable or the same among the each group the exclusion of any other variables and the giving of the special treatment or the intervention to the experimental group whilst holding every other variable constant for the two groups the importance of randomization randomization is a key critical element of the true experiment random sampling and random allocation to either a controlled experimental group is a key way of allowing for the very many additional uncontrolled and hence unmeasured variables that may be part of makeup of the groups in question. It is an attempt to overcome the confounding effect of exogenous and endogenous variables. The catalyst variables condition or all other things being equal, it assumes that the distribution of these extraneous variables is more or less even and perhaps of little signification. significance. How do you know if the experiment has worked? Research one to know if their experiment has worked. How can they be assured of this? There are several answers to this question. One approach is to use null hypothesis significance testing. Null hypothesis significance testing or NHST strive to determine whether result found. For example, whether an intervention make a difference and is or is not by chance. And effect size. Effect size is a weighted use measure of difference. Effect size is usually measured in standard deficient units with different measure used for different numbers of groups. A two group design, a design with more than two groups. Considering rival explanation, this approach is designed to enable the research to know how much confidence can be placed in the result obtained. Here, the research has to consider alternative. Rival explanation for the findings and then define the claim that this, this rival explanation are not as persuasive as the interpretation proffered. For example, that intervention has not only caused the observed finding, rather than other factors, but has also caused the magnitude of the observed finding. Design in educational, ed, educational experiment. There are several different kind of experimental design, such as the controlled experiment in laboratory condition or two true experiment, two or more group and the randomized, randomized 
control tri trial and the field or quasi experiment in the natural setting rather than the labo laboratory but where variable are isolated controlled and manipulated and the natural experiment in which it it's not possible to isolate and control variables and the retrospective experiment where the researcher moved from an observed effect and test to find the like cause ex post facto research and through experimental design there are several variants of the true experiment design and we consider many of these below first the pretest post test control and experimental group design and the two control groups and one experimental group pretest post test design the post test control and experimental group design and for the post test two experimental group design five the pretest post test to treatment design six the match pairs design seven the factorial design eight the parametric design and the last repeat measure design quasi experimental design quasi experiment come in several form for example pre experimental design the one group pre test post test design the one group post test only design the non equal equivalent post test only design pre test post test non equal equivalent group design and the last one group time series and single case ab ab design most the single case st studies care are in the this and other areas share the following characteristic first they involve the continuous assessment of some aspect of humans therefore the be behavior over the period of time required requiring on the part of the researcher the administration of measure, measure on multiple occasion within spare pairs of study second the involved intervention event which are replicate and the same subject over time the design experiment the outdoors not seven feature of design experiment one they focus on intervention in authentic real world setting two the role of theory is important in providing a rationale for the intervention in the testing the theory is a key purpose of design experiment three they have the improvement of practice as their goal for example how to improve teaching and learning in authentic setting for they are interactive in their data collection gathering data as the intervention evolve over time and across sites seek contextual factor influence but positive and negatively what happened and the side of intervention and hence the design experiment data collection employs multiple method the last they are root root in the pragmatism okay that's all about case studies and experiment Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh